Welcome back. Fundraiser for the Special Olympics. It's another interactive type production uh, and it's going to be hilarious. It's an 80s murder mystery. Uh, joining us to talk about it is sitting next to me, Alicia Ashcroft. And uh, sitting next to you, we have Alandra Barton, the director. You're acting in this production yes. and you're the director. Welcome to the show. Thank you for Thank having you. us. In years past, Joey and Julia got married. That was uh, the, the theme, to, like to Tina and Tony's wedding. Most of us have heard about that. You can sort of be involved as much as you want in the production. Um, this won't be dissimilar to that. No, it's going to be almost, it's a similar sense of you coming as a guest and coming in enjoying a meal and being at the table and being involved with the actors. And it's a, it's a high school reunion. Mm -hmm. So basically you can show up and pretend you're Susie from Biology 11 or you can also not be involved. My husband's always like, do I have to like say anything? You don't have to say anything. <laughs> you don't have um, to. But if you'd like to be involved the more the merrier. Okay, so let's hear about your role. You are Olivia Applebottom. You're a teacher. Yes, a uh, retired teacher. Olivia Applebottom Bush, if I include my <laughs> husband's last name. Now, my husband went to, to prison um, for a little indiscretion with a high school student, <laughs> and it was quite, you know, destructive to our marriage. Played by Dushan Magdalene from the uh, Home Festival. He's awesome. Yeah. Yes, oh my gosh, I'm so thrilled. Uh, and so then, so that's our story, but there's a whole bunch of other stories as well, but there's a high school student that comes back and she's famous and she's putting a lot of thorns and a lot of sides and there's a lot of reasons to get rid of her. <laughs> <laughs> Hence the murder mystery. Hence the murder mystery. So Alandra, you're the director. How's it all going? Uh, you know, it's really come together. It's great. Uh, we kind of started with a really bone, uh, bone bare skeleton in the beginning mm -hmm. and kind of built it up as a team and it's really taken a, an amazing shape. I'm very pleased with it. <laughs> so this is at the Fairfield, in, no, the Pacific Inn. Pacific Inn. And that's uh, in Lower Aberdeen, I'm pretty sure. Yes. Yeah. And so it just works. You come, you come for dinner. Uh, everybody's sort of, uh, you don't really know who's a casting character member until you start seeing things unfold and it sort of unfolds around you as you're eating dinner? Uh, you, well, it's just basically as soon as you show up, you'll get a sense of who the actors are, but we are encouraging people to dress up. Everyone's mm -hmm. going to be in the 80s wear. Awesome. Um, but we'll certainly, the most theatrical people in the room will be <laughs> the actors, <laughs> yes. most likely. <laughs> yes. But yeah, we'll hit the ground running and there'll be a lot uh, a lot going on and there'll be, uh, there's a, a, quite a bit of singing and dancing. And <laughs> yes, there's a few guest <laughs> numbers. <laughs> Is that right? Yes. So there's a little something for, for everyone, as uh, always. It's some great pictures here. I know that uh, we're going to courtesy uh, the great photographer who made these possible. So thank yes, you Lynn to Lynn Sunderman. Lynn Sunderman for that. Um, so it just looks like you're just having fun even just doing the rehearsals here. Yeah, we're always having a good time. And it's what I love about a show like this is that it's a real collective. So you're not just given a script. You can make up your character. You can take things in directions. You have suggestions when you start off. Sure. But some things work, some things don't, some things stick, some things get dropped. Um, and you know what? You don't even know how it's going to go until you have the audience. That's <laughs> The, that's the so thing that's true. really right. fun. So as one of the actors, of course, Alicia, you're hoping that people are going to come and want to interact and be fun, right? Because you guys feed off of that. Yes, absolutely. Um, but we also prepare ourselves for people not being interested in that and putting on a show for them. Because, you know, sure. at the end of the day, they've come and they've bought a ticket and they want to have a meal and they want to be entertained and not everyone is going to want to jump in. So as much as we do encourage it, you can just come and be yourself and we will we'll do the work for you. That is so much fun. Uh, <laughs> so if people want tickets, the information is there on the screen, 3180715. Uh, they can also go to SoBC, Special Olympics BC Counts.org, but also Facebook. Uh, easy enough there, of course, as well to get a ticket uh, if you're interested. This is not this weekend, but next, next weekend. weekend. Yes. Fabulous. Yeah. Don't don't miss it. It's it's gonna be a lot of fun. And yeah. it's for a great cause too. So. Yeah, yes. great cause. And it stays the funding stays local for local athletes, which is really important. Fantastic. All right, we can pull away from that. Again, a special thanks to Lynn Sunderman for making those uh, pictures possible. Uh, and uh, anything else you guys want to add? No, just keep keep an eye out for social media, mm -hmm. and uh, we'll be keeping updated right up until the show. And go out and get some shoulder pads, and some, some <laughs> See on. big hair. Really, yeah. get, just really get those bangs out there. Yeah. And come and make it. There's fun. so many closet '80s hair people out there that are just dying to wear. I know. That I have a friend it. that's like, I wonder if I could make my hair as big as I used to. <laughs> that's right. Get out the ice mask. Yeah. <laughs> Ladies, thank you for being thank here today. You so much. Thank you. Very welcome. We will be back with Pet of the Week in just a minute. Stay with us.